looking at Crazy 8. This is the first time you can get this card available as an elf army. You can see that he's no longer neutral in this version. He has the aqua army uh, color. His ability is really good. Starting with you, you take turns rolling two dice. You can reroll ones, your opponent cannot. Whoever rolls eight first wins that round. This ability cannot be negated. So if you go up against someone really powerful, you have a great chance of beating them because all you have to do is roll an eight and you get to reroll one. So one, if you know, you can't ever get an eight because six plus one is seven. So you always get to reroll. You always have a chance for an eight. Okay, you're looking at Chalice, a member of the Sagaheim Wizard Council, power four. He can be included in any good army. His ability is Lucky Rabbit. Before battle, roll two dice. If you roll a seven, your foe goes to dungeon. Reroll doubles. If no seven is rolled, then battle is normal. So seven is a kind of a lucky number, and you get a chance to beat out anyone. He is power four, so he has a good opportunity to go face face up some pretty tough guys. Arson and Soot are back. The Troll Brothers. They are uh, haven't been in packs for a long, long time, but they are back there in a faction thermo. One is called Shadow Troll. That's Arson. You can battle your foe or choose a different one from their hand, and they're plus one versus commons. And they are, uh, so there are five versus common. Most commons only go up to three, so you're always an advantage. Soot, blackout, before battle, roll a dice. If you roll two or higher, then you can deduct one power from your foe or your own power. So, Soot can be a three, or if he's going against someone, uh, he can get more power so he's he's pretty cool both of these guys are versatile both in packs right now sir garnet he is the squire or former squire of sir crimson now king crimson and this is a fan created character you can see ms on the side there uh, he, he's power four rivalry bad sir drake he has a big showdown so you got to beat him twice and his ability called Swift Blade, Sir Garnet wins ties. If he loses a round of battle, his power goes to five. If he wins, it goes back to four. So he's actually pretty good, especially with that winning the tie. One of the big cards out is Orion. He is the Elf Archer, brother to Andromeda and Aurora. Power four, very good for an archer. Uh, rivalry all dragon lords and you'll see why in a moment he has the dragon bane arrows before battle roll a dice if you roll a six then your foe is removed from game if your foe is a dragon it's removed on a five or six so that's a really good ability when you're going up against dragons and he has to if they're in an epic battle because he's rival here is grindel son of grindel power four he hasn't been in packs in a long time he has Big Showdown, and he also has the ability, before battle, you can switch places with Grindel unless he's in the dungeon. So if you're playing a Grindel deck, this guy is great to have in there, and he's not too bad at Power 4 and Big Showdown. So this guy is in packs now, and we hope that you're able to get him if you're a Grindel fan. So that's it for this session of Combat Club. We'll see you tomorrow with some looks at the common cards.